Hello and welcome to this short video on the Python print statement. And we'll be specifically examining the use of end, the end parameter, and the SEP parameter or the separator parameter as used in the Python print statement. So there we start. I've already made a Python find and I've written three statements over here print one, print two, print three. Now watch this. I run this program. One, the first statement is printed on one line, second one on the second line, and the third one on the third line. Now, what if I want to print it all in the same line? Then I'll write end is equal to see, a blank string here. Now, what happens? One and two is printed on the same line, and three on the next line. So the end actually the end parameter or argument defines what is printed at the end of a print statement. By default, it is a new line character, and we can change it as and when we want. See, I'll write slash n over here. Then it will be printed as before. If I leave it blank, it's printed on the same line. If I put a comma here, then it will put commas between the two lines. I can define end for the next statement as well. I put in a semicolon here. So one, then comma two, and then we should have a semicolon and then have three. Okay. Now, what is the use of the SCP statement? Let's see. I'll print this in the same statement. What's this? Print one, two, and comma. Then three. No. I've got one here and two. The first print statement has two parameters, printing one and two. And the third one prints three. So what happens? One and two printed are the are printed on the same line, and three is printed on the next line, and we've got a space in between. Where did this space come from? This comes from the SEP parameter, the separator. Now what's this? I put a comma here. So now we've got a comma over here. Then three comes up. I can also define end if I want. End is equal to, let's say we'll put a semicolon here. Now what? One, then the separator comes in and we get a comma here. Then two, then the statement ends. And we've got a semicolon because of the end and then we get three. I put another value over here. Four. What's this? One, two, four, three. So, what happens if we summarize? You will be knowing that hash is a command character in Python. SCP is the separator between two print arguments and is the character that is printed after the complete print statement. There you are. I'll save this. Let us try one more statement. What is this? Let's say I want to print a pyramidical type figure.
tall inverted triangle. Made a mistake over here. Put a single quote instead of a double quote. Now let me run this. See, one, two, three, and four printed on the same line. Now all I need to do is to define the separator here and put it slash n. Assign slash n to the separator character. What is this? Okay. For more, you can refer to my post on compostworld.com. Thanks for watching.